All right, coming up next, a welterweight tilt between Bruce Lee and Colby Covington. All right, so the fight is now underway on one side here, the fighter who does everything well, taking on a... Whoa! Oh, big left. Holding on to him here, not really doing too much, perhaps just looking to recover. He blocks the punch. Good right here. Back to the overhand right, not there. Two minutes now to go in the opening round. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Both guys throwing potential fight enders here in the early going. Oh, so an interesting decision there as he decides to stand up and relinquish the dominant position. Stuffs the takedown there. How good is this takedown defense? And they separate. This is his game. He likes to control his opponent's posture with that collar tie and land those nice elbows on the ball. And another kick. Nice one-two combination there. Oh! Oh! That's a big hole. And now his opponent in a world of trouble. Such a sneaky head kick he did not recognize. Hurt bad. Oh, and he's back up again. Beautiful punch. Whoa! That key strike right there. I'm not sure how many more of these his opponent can take. Massive shot that he landed. Great job. Round two coming up next. All right, let's check out something. All right, round two. Oh, that is as big a strike as he has landed thus far tonight. Big, massive shot lands. Look at how tough his opponent is, though. Still standing, still in their fight. That one landed clean. Single collar tie now. Stuffs that takedown attempt without issue. Oh, he gets the team. All right, so a near-perfect entry there, and finally he gets his first takedown of the fight, and they say, if at first you don't succeed, try, try again, was able to get him down there. Persistence pays, and that is... Oh, huge strike lands there. Somehow, his opponent stayed up there. I mean, he's still on his feet, but he's not up by much. Cool. Huge body shot. Nice kick right there. Tell the masses how, how good that feels to get kicked like that. Johnny does. It doesn't feel good to be kicked like that. But he needs to check one. That one appeared to stun him. Who's hurt? Serve him up. Go get him. Oh, he might be out. He ate that kick. He took that whole kick, yep. Well, he's really picked up the pace here in round two. Much more aggressive now here and starting to find himself in the pocket. John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Oh, straight right. Whoa! Oh! Entertaining scrap so far. All right, so big round for him there. Maybe even a 10-8. There was a big knockdown in there. Could Third round underway. Oh, nice strike landed there by Luke. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. And a nice job at least staying upright on that. Back to his feet. I mean, look at the commitment to kicking in this fight. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Trying to... You don't really stop. 
understand, after you take a head kick like this, that is such toughness to even be on his feet right now. And they separate. They're switching stances here. And there's the shot, and there's the land. Nice takedown there by Covington. Well, these are some excellent ground and pound strikes here, DC. There's an efficiency with which he operates in these situations. He knows exactly when to throw, exactly when to hold, and it's allowing him to really control the grappling aspect of the fight. There's a song there, right? Know when to hold him, know, know when, when to hold him. Yep, there you absolutely. Go. Well, he's in a compromising spot here, DC. You gotta figure out a way to get back to your feet. All right, he's got side control here, DC. You know, he's got a lot of different submissions in his arsenal once this fight gets to the ground. All right, bottom fighter here, maybe looking to hip escape, DC. 30 seconds now to go in the round. Well, not much set up behind it, the right hook misses. Oh, huge right hand! Seconds winding down in round three. What a round. Pulsing, it's a pretty Okay, you ready? You ready? Let's go fight! Down to three. Oh, a violent strike to the body. This could be the end of this fight. is close to being stopped. That was a massive shot to the body. Now goes in and secures the takedown. Postured up there, gained some valuable separation. And now, the ground and pound starts. Outstanding ground and pound here. Somewhat of a lost art in MMA, at least in terms of making sure that every strike counts. Not an issue for him. He's making every single one of them count. He is not pity pad. He's not touching. Every punch that lands, he wants you to feel it. Oh, big combination of ground and pound strikes here, DC. This could be the beginning of the end. I mean, you gotta be very careful when you take these big ground and pound strikes. You need a control posture on the bottom, and if you're the top guy, the guy that's going to finish, continue to gain posture and rain down big strikes in your opponent. All right, so inside the open guard of his opponent, you gotta be careful playing around for too long here on the ground with this guy. Well, you see all the grappling repetitions here. Just beautiful movement, seamless transitions on the ground. Over and over, these guys are doing things that you see in every jiu-jitsu gym around the country. Oh, nicely done there as he escapes back to his feet. Just misses there with the left. Takedown defense holds up. All right, well, he's got him softened up here. Oh, so an interesting decision there is he just... Oh! He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very bad. Oh! He's trouble. He's so bad. Whoa! That was nasty! A near-perfect strike to end the fight and end the night for his opponent, who candidly may not have even seen that shot coming. So just the way he drew it up, Exactly what he told us during fight week played out here on fight night. He found a little opening in his opponent's defense and barged right through it. Bruce Buffer has your official decision. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mugliano has called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 55 seconds of round number four. Declaring the winner, Bob.